to do. It's this finger here. You should be straightening it out. Oh, you straighten it out. Yeah, you have to have a crease in it. it sounds like a burner. Yeah. Right here. What are these called? Yeah, okay. First part of the art is to do this. Whoop, it didn't work. Not that, no. Part of the art is to snap it up out of the air. So this is this is the latest handy you got. You know how this works? Did you see? I don't know how this is done, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start making one of these out. Yeah. It doesn't mean a thing. No, no, I'm just gonna no. invent it. But this technology. I just yeah. learned about it two weeks ago. Yeah. You know, it's just you can make one up that goes to like Google or something. Yeah. So people, you know, they think there must be something wrong because it's like, wait a minute, I'm going to Google. What's 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 wrong? Well this you can do you can do like posters and people can just go like this. They don't have to go close up to it. Yeah. Put it on posters, you want to put it on yeah, it's one of these fancy new. Let me put my beard on. One of these fancy new technologies that. I'm afraid it might be supernatural. Well, pareidolia. Only if it said ever could ever ever could ever. But that's right. The computers are the devil's work. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the uh, uh, the woo to come out with uh, pareidolia on it and start seeing things into the pictures and. You know that's what's going to happen next. I think I see a dragonfly. Oh, there's so many things I, I see in there. What I see is that somebody looking at it and saying, you know, the psychic moves. I just found it. That's what I'm next hoping. That's a good stuff, too. What's that? Wait a minute, wait a minute, I got a mentalism stuff. Yeah, what? Yeah, you could, you could easily you set up a scanner or something like that. It's very easy. Yeah. At your, at your table where you're working and say, right. you know, you say something like, well, you yeah, scan it at that thing and look down and see the answer right there and say, oh, that's, that's, oh, that's yeah, true. Oh, that's true. true. I'm sure somebody's got marked oh, it I'm already. sure it's already there. <laughs> really. And the t-shirt, too. You know, yeah, and the t-shirt, yeah. These are great. So this was taken in uh, Israel? <coughs> no, that's in uh, Oslo, Norway. Couldn't that's be wrong. Great shot. Wronger. <laughs> You know what I'm waiting for? I'm waiting for when I scanner technology, maybe it's there already, will be able to read this, but it will be invisible to like a person's eye. Yeah. So, you know, the people will be... Going I don't know who this guy is, a stranger, he just walked out. He's very weird. I, I have problems. <laughs> Here you yeah. go. <laughs> now, I do prefer this primer though. I, I, well, we'll see what happens with it. I, I don't take money. I, I take oh, well, that's <laughs> I was going to ask, is that $5? Is that with, with the signature or without? I don't the know. Well, you want one of these, young man? Yes, I want one of those. It's like the, what is it, the Groucho Marx gag? Where I want one of those for my hall of infamy. And the woman asks, you know, how much... Uh, at to whom shall I inscribe? To Mark? I think you should, you should write it to Mark. Yes. Okay. Mark uh, John Edward. And again, thank you so much for the forward. I think that was one of the things that pushed it over. Oh, well, it might. We don't know. I mean, saying that it was akin to Nightmare Alley is one of the highest praises I've heard so far. It's unfortunate that not many people know about Nightmare Alley. That's very true. <laughs> but it's growing. It, I got that impression. Yeah. Strictly right away. Yeah. Well, I've added, I've added some, some even darker parts to it because the publisher, Feral House, he's really into uh, his whole byline for his publishing company is forbidden knowledge. And what he does is he sells these books that look like you're going to learn some sort of secret when you read them. Like he has, he has like a book on Alistair Crowley and Anton LaVey. And, yeah. But the cover's really lured and you look at it and go, oh my god, i got to get this. I want to learn about Satan, the Church of Satan and your new dance. You find out he was a carnival guy. So the guy's really smart. He's, he's cornering a market there. And you know, I tried to, I told you about Prometheus. They said, well, we don't publish fiction. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, sure they don't. Yeah. Anyway, wait, wait. This, this pen itself here is a bit of interesting technology. No, you can stick my this. eye out. <laughs> no, by doing this, yeah. the, the head retreats, but there's a little cap. Yeah. It flops over a little cone that, that flops over the head because otherwise, even inside, it would dry out yeah. very easily. Yeah. But this is it, it not, it's exposed now, but when it retreats inside, right. it's got a little cap, little little cap, comes over it very tightly. 
It shows some sort of magic yeah. trick or something. <laughs> no, but no, it's just a, a piece of technology. What can I say? Hello? Hello? Not, not working now. Well, Randy, it's always good to see you. I'll see you later in the night. I'm glad we saw you here. I expected you to show up. Yeah. Not with this damn beard, but. Uh, <laughs> Well, I hope that gets in front of your lens. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good afternoon. Thanks, Randy. I will. I'll do what I can.